Mirror's Edge is a game that's focused very heavily on movement. We've had parkour artists come in, talk to us. They can teach us a lot about the moves that we have in the game and how we can also expand on it. We're building on the first Mirror's Edge when it comes to the moveset that Faith has. Everything is geared towards traversing and navigating this environment. We want the player to be able to experiment and find different paths in the environment. You know that you can get there, but how? And that's when you explore, you know, not just the environment, but also what is it that Faith can do. So for the skilled player, they might find the quickest, the fastest, the most rewarding path for them. Somebody with less skill might find a safer, a longer route. It's important for us that everybody who wants to play the game can play the game. And not only are we building a broad moveset, we're also building combat with the moveset in mind. You would analyze the geometry in a combat encounter to, to see how you can use that against the enemy. When we talk about combat, we are selecting very special sounds for that. We're having very tight, controlled hits. They kind of speak about Faith's power and efficiency because she is a projectile. Whenever she does hit, she hits quick, fast and hard and then moves on. Here is where I started. The simplest building blocks of Faith. And that would be the white, the red, the blacks. Of course, we kept the glove. That in itself is iconic for her. The style and tone of the game implies that everything we do needs to be elegant, minimalistic, and it has to have a certain attitude. She's a runner. She's very strong. The overall look should give them a sense that, well, you shouldn't mess around with Faith. We are redefining the role of the runners to allow for more varied gameplay, for more varied experience. We will expand on who she is in this world. Why is she doing what she's doing? What's her reason for being Faith? This is a girl that actually tattooed her eye. You do it for a reason. It's to make a point. We are creating faith for a new generation.